good morning dear students i'm happy to meet you all with another video presentation like this as usual in this particular video presentation we'll continue with the remaining sums on exercise 1.1 of set theory from 9th standard state board the third sum goes like this consider the following sets you are given some sets i'll write down the sets anyway a is equal to let us say a has element 0 3 5 8 0 comma 3 comma 5 comma 8 then b has elements i need to say 2 4 6 10 2 4 6 10 and c has elements 12 14 18 20 let me check once again a has elements 0 3 5 8 and b has elements 2 4 6 10 c has 12 14 18 20 state whether the following are true or false that is the first submission there are various submission you need to check whether it, they are true or false 18 belongs to c it is true 18 is there in this thing okay and this is my first submission then for the second submission he has given 6 does not belong to a that is also true that is also true third one okay 6 is not there. 14 does not belong to C. 14 does not belong to C. This is false. Because 14 is there in the given set. It is anyway false. Next one. 10 belongs to B. 10 belongs to B. That is true. 10 is there in B. Then fifth one he says. 5 belongs to B. That is false. 5 is not there in the given set B. Then sixth one. I mean to say. 0 belongs to B. That is also false. That is also false. 0 is there only in A, not in B. Let me just repeat the answer. 18 belongs to C. The symbol is belongs to. 18 belongs to C. Yes, 18 is there in C. Therefore, it is true. 6 does not belong to A. 6 is not there in A. That is true. Therefore, that is true. 6 is not there in A. 6 is there only in B. Then of course 14 does not belong to A. That is true. 14 is not there. In, 14 does not belong to C. Sorry. That is uh, uh, does not belong to C. That is false. Because uh, 14 is there in C. Then 10 belongs to B. That is uh, uh, true anyway. Then 5 belongs to B. That is wrong. That is false. Then 6th one says 0 belongs to B. 0 belongs to A. 0 belongs to A. B is false. Anyway that is false. Okay, then next one is fill up the blanks. Okay, let me continue. Fill up the blanks. You are supposed to fill up uh, the uh, whatever is needed. Let us see. You see here, you are given submission 1. There are various submissions. He says, first one he says, uh, 3 belongs to, 3 belongs to which set A. Okay, this is what is to be filled up. Then second one he means to say 14 belongs to 14 belongs to C anyway 14 belongs to C then 18 dash 18 dash B 18 belongs to uh, does not belong to B 18 does not belong to B then 4 dash B 4 dash B 4 belongs to B 4 belongs to B okay 4 belongs to B let me just repeat if you want. I'll rub this once again and write properly. Belongs to. 4 belongs to. Let me just check. I have to fill up uh, certain dash questions here. Fill in the blank. That is the question given as B uh, as your third question. Okay. He says 3 dash. Uh, um, it belongs to dash. For 3 belongs to A. Then 14 belongs to dash. 14 belongs to C. In 18 dash B, 18 does not belong to B, and of course 4 belongs to B. Therefore, these are the fill-ups we have to do. Then for the fourth problem, let me continue. I represent the following sets in roster form. And so roster form means I have to write the elements as it is. I have to write the elements as it is. Okay, just see what is given. Set of all even natural numbers less than 20. That is your A. A is equal to capital A is equal to set of all even natural numbers less than 20. What do I get? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 
12, 14, 16, 18. Less than 20 is given. Therefore, 20 shouldn't be included. Let me just check once again. Okay, he says mm, the set of all even natural numbers less than 20. For even natural numbers means starts only natural number starts only from 1, 2, 3, 4, etc. Even number means 2, 4, 6, 8, up to 18. I should write. Then uh, second one he says, see here, why is such that? Why is such that? Why is such that? Why is equal to 1 by 2n? Why is equal to 1 by 2n? n element of n, n element of natural numbers and n is less than 5, n is less than 5. Okay, let me substitute the various values. When n equal 1, I will get it to be half. n equal to 4, it is 1 by 4. This is 1 by 6, then 1 by 8. These are the things I am supposed to write down. He says y equal to 1 by 2n. All the y's I am supposed to write. How do I write? When n is equal to 1, it is 1 by 2. When n equal to 2, it is 1 by 4. n equal to 3, it is 1 by 6. When n equal to 4, it is 1 by 8. Then uh, C says, uh, C says, x is a perfect cube. Perfect cube means 1 cube, 2 cube, that is 1, 8, 27, 64, such numbers are called perfect cubes. Cubes are various numbers. Or when I take cube root, it will be a whole number. That is the real meaning of perfect cube. Such numbers are called perfect cubes. The third, third submission says x is a perfect cube. See here. x is a perfect cube. And uh, you mean to say 27 less than x less than 216. See here. 27 is 3 cube. And of course, and you are uh, so 216 is 6 cube. You can check 36 into 6. Okay, 36 into 6, you can check. Yeah, 216. Therefore, I mean to say simply is 4 cube and 5 cube here. That is the one you are supposed to do. This is nothing but 64, 125. Those are the elements in C. Let me just repeat once again. Let me just check once again. He says, set of all, plus, uh, x is a perfect cube. 27 less than x less than 216. 27 is 3 cube and 216 is 6 cube. Now for I have to write 4 cube and 5 cube. 4 cube is 64. 5 cube is 125. Okay. Then the last one he says D. Let me just rub this off. Rub this part and proceed. I'll just rub this part and proceed. Then only I'll be able to continue. Okay. Let me continue here. Last part over here, he says, last part, he says, last part over here, he says, what is given, one second, uh, x is an integer, that is the fourth submission, d is equal to x such that x is an integer such that minus 5 less than x less than 2. How do you list the element? Minus 4, minus 3, minus 2, minus 1, 0, 1. Up to 1 I should write. From minus 4 to 1 I should write. You are given only less than. If you are given less than or equal to, I will include the end value. Okay. Otherwise, I will not include the end values. I will not include the end values. Okay. For the first problem, he says... For the fifth problem, represent the following sets in the set builder form. Okay, everything in, it is given in terms of descriptive form. I am supposed to write in set builder form. You, he means to say, first submission, B is equal to set of all cricket players in India who scored double centuries in one day international. Set of all X is that. X is a cricket player. Who got, who got double centuries, double centuries in one day international, one day international. This is how you should write. For the second submission, for the second submission, he says, just see here, Q equal to, uh, sorry, C is equal to, sorry, C is equal to, Half comma two by three comma three by four comma etc. How do you write this? Set of all x as z. X is equal to n by n plus one 
n element of uh, natural numbers sorry n element of set of natural numbers n is a natural number okay see here when n is 1 it is 1 by 2 when n is 2 it is 2 by 3 when n is 3 it is 3 by 4 now for set of all n by n plus 1 n element of n that's what i'm supposed to write okay it's easier for you to think over it's easier for you to think over just see here then for the third submission he means to say he says d is equal to Set of all Tamil months in a year. Set of all Tamil months in a year. That is D. Am I right? Yeah. Now for X or Z, X is a Tamil month. S is a Tamil month in a year. In a year. Then of course for the last one he says D is equal to what is given. You see here. Set of all all whole numbers less than 9. X or Z x is an odd whole number x is an odd whole number less than 9 that is how you are supposed to write set of all x or z x is an odd whole number less than 9 this is how you are supposed to write okay this is how you are supposed to write then let me finish the next one also it will take maximum uh, 3 minutes we will be able to finish before 15 minutes 15th minute we will be able to finish Okay, the sixth sum goes like this. Just see here. He says represent the following sets in descriptive form. Okay, it is given in roster form. Write in descriptive form. Okay, he says this is the sixth problem. P is equal to January, June, July. Set of all, set of all English months. English months starting with starting with j starting with j okay january june july okay then q says next one he means to say 7 11 13 17 19 23 29 those are prime numbers how do you write set of set of all prime numbers set of all prime numbers prime numbers between 6 and 30 between 6 and 30 greater than 6 and less than 30 that is the meaning then for the third one he says he says r equal to x or z x is the n r equal to set of all x or z x element of n and x less than 5 what do it it means set of all set of all first four natural numbers first four natural numbers first four natural numbers that is the meaning then the last one he says last one in that particular subdivision his x is a consonant in english alphabets how do you write set of all set of all consonants consonants of english alphabets of english alphabets that is what you are supposed to write if right in the descriptive form it is called uh, which a description i am supposed to write it's supposed to be in descriptive form these are the things you are supposed to do okay anyway uh, rest we'll discuss in the next video thank you students for patient watching